Good morning. I hope you guys all had a wonderful night and are ready for a great, beautiful Saturday. Um, I thought I'd come today and talk to you a little bit about um, Sarah's coffee cake. I don't know if you've been in and tried our coffee cake. It's not like your traditional American coffee cake. Um, it's a buttermilk base with butter and cinnamon flavors. And then the icing is um, butter, because why not more butter? Uh, coffee, cocoa powder, and powdered sugar. And this is an old Norwegian recipe, and I actually learned to make that from my great aunt when she was about 85 and I was about 13. And that cake has followed me all these very many years, and it's one of my favorites, uh, both because it tastes great, it's not too sweet, um, and because it reminds me of uh, Mostal Saba, my great aunt. She was such a remarkable woman. She's one of the strongest women that I've known, but then I come from a long line of very strong women that immediately starts with my mom and then her mom and then their mom and so on and so forth. So um, the same on my uh, dad's side of the family. My grandmother was, yeah, she was a strong human and I'm grateful to to come from such a long line of strong women. But anyway, back to Mostal Saga. So um, one of the stories that um, I like to tell about her is that she used to be in charge of a retirement home uh, back during the war in, in Norway. And during World War II, uh, they had rations and, and they did not always, according to her, they did not always get enough food to feed um, the people that were part of that um, retirement living uh, properly. And so at one point she uh, got on a train back to um, the farm where she grew up and they slaughtered a cow. And then she smuggled back all that meat on the train and she did not get caught, which is incredible. Uh, she definitely had some nerves of steel, that woman. Um, and I'm grateful that I um, have been taught this cake and that I can share that with you guys um, so you can get a little bit part of that history. Um, thanks for watching these silly videos that I make. Um, it means a lot to me that you guys support me um, as the owner, but us in general, um, you have no idea what you've been able to do for our family. And I just wanna, from the bottom of my heart, thank you guys for being part of our journey. Have a great day.